Hey everybody, uh, welcome to the VHF UHF channel. And I've uh, actually I brought out my trusty old um, realistic Pro 43 or Radio Shack scanner that I purchased. Wow, this scanner radio is something like 25 years old, roughly. I'm trying to remember when I purchased this, but um, wow, it goes back 25 and even more than 25 years of age. Uh, this was my main scanner radio for, for a while back then. And uh, the reason I purchased this one is because it has the uh, v the uh, UHF airband and military band and wanted to listen to some military stuff on it, which I did for a while because there was a uh, Air Force base in Plattsburgh, New York. And when that was operational, when the planes were up in the air, I could actually hear them all the way here to Montreal on the military band, which was kind of a lot of fun to monitor. Now, that ba that uh, military base has shut down, and um, since then, well, there's really not been much military. Of course, there are some UHF comms from uh, the airport, but uh, it's been rather quiet. But today, we're going to use this because I get messages and, and emails from people saying, hey, you just use these fancy radios, and, you know, it's not the real world of everybody. And, yeah, you're totally right. There are people out there that have little scanner radios that are more... Uh, down to earth radios now even though this one is still a good model it's more it's closer to performance and to what regular scanner radios are and we're going to demonstrate actually one thing today with this is that there is a possibility to receive some satellites in orbit using this uh of course it's not going to be like you know listening to satellites with uh, my more expensive radios in my outdoor antenna because i'll be using the uh, telescopic, this uh, wideband telescopic as my main antenna on it. Of course, I could have done it with the rubber duck antenna also, which would probably be even closer to what people have at home. But uh, we'll be uh, checking that. And we'll actually try to receive some satellites with it. Uh, maybe the Cosmos uh, navigation satellite telemetry. Or um, even maybe some, um, you know, uh, NOAA weather satellites just to see if we can receive their signals. And uh, just using telescopic, just using a regular scanner radio and see uh, if the signals come in, including the telemetry uh, and the signals from like the ARPCOM and stuff like that. I'll even try my hand at receiving the FOX 1B, 1A satellites that have uh, that are repeaters in the sky. That will be more difficult, but uh, we'll try it. We'll see where, uh, if, if it's possible and if I hear anything. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.